Columbus City Schools partnering with the Save the Music Foundation to give schools and specifically art programs the money to continue offering programs for music education. NBC4's Austin Martin was there as the Boeing began. You can hear behind me the halls filled with music for the first time since 2019. The Columbus City Schools and the Save the Music Foundation partnering today to give students and staff the chance to learn and four grants to continue their education here in the city. So I want you to, to get into it just like you listen to um, Lil Baby or just like you listen to Ariana Grande. 125 students from several city schools showing up to share their love for music for the first time since the pandemic began. For participants, a welcome change. I played, I practiced, I got like music books from the library, but also um, we, had, we would play on Zoom, so that was interesting. Nearly a dozen educators helping with this annual grant program a new grant for four of our schools, but this is a strings grant, a core foundational grant, and it will be announced today in four of our, our schools. To provide these types of class settings, but also provide schools more needed equipment. I don't know, I think it's an interesting opportunity because like we have all violins mm -hmm. and so when we get to play with other instruments, it's fun. And that's going to come in handy. When we came out of the pandemic, we had um, an unbelievable interest in uh, string instruments. We couldn't keep up with the demand. And so that really inspired this interest in um, reaching out to uh, Save the Music and to ha have them help us um, meet the demand. The grant's part of a 25-year cooperation, making sure the music lives on. Today wrapped up with a concert. For more information about this event and events throughout the year that Columbus City Schools say are so important to our youth, you can head to our website, NBC4i.com. Local for you at East High School in Columbus, Austin Martin, NBC4.